Here is the normal grave digger, and here is the custom made energy grave digger. Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Jakers and welcome back to another Fortnite video on the channel and in today's Save the World video we're going to be taking a look at the rarest schematics to ever exist that have recently been added into the game. Before we start today's video I'd like to say that if you're new then make sure to drop a sub because we make Save the World content very regularly on this channel. Also in today's video we'll be sharing some very new fresh information. You may have seen Checker's video where he showed off the Fire Nocturno but there's also some other weapons including the Fire Nocturno which are absolutely so rare to get your hands on and cost a ton. We're also running a few giveaways on the channel. Right now we're doing some 2800 V-Buck giveaway which the link for is for some reason broken so me and Endo are going to be looking into that and trying to fix it as soon as possible but also you can get involved in a Nocturno 106 giveaway in the description um, if you can't get involved in the V-Buck giveaway and they're the same methods and you get an awesome prize if you win the Nocturno and also soon if you'd like to see a friend code um, for Fortnite Save the World being uh, given away on the channel then make sure to let me know in the comments section why you think you deserve it and also support the channel by dropping a like subscribing and turning on notifications I'd also like to really thank you guys for the support on the channel we've hit 80,000 subscribers and I can't thank you guys enough for that so two days ago I found out that Fire Nocturno exists in the game and there's only maybe about 20 different copies of this weapon to ever exist in Fortnite which is insane but there's actually a few other different types of Nocturnos and Grave Diggers that are out there that are extremely rare and that are actually real and exist. Now how did people get their hands on these weapons you may ask? Well. Epic Games have made a lot of mistakes in their time of developing Fortnite and some of the mistakes that they've made include maybe wiping people's inventories, making it so that they're unable to play the game, removing their founders pack without no reason at all and because of this they've had a lot of backlash especially in the communities on Reddit and all their forum posts and their emails and so on the support service once you get a ticket people were given the opportunity to get compensation for all of these different errors that were happening on their account and people were furious um, because all of these things were happening to them so some of the epic games developers turned around and said well we'll give you some custom schematics you can tell us what stats you want and what you want it to have on it and we'll give it to you and this has made the people that own the ultimate edition which gives you which grants you the access to the nocturno schematic it has made these people furious because they paid over 250 dollars for this and people have just been granted it for free just because of a small error so after seeing checkers video i went and done my own research and looked up a load of information about all of these different modded weapons so what they are is they're basically type of modded weapons because they're they're not like the base weapon they're not like the elemental normal version so the Nocto nocturno of course we all know that it comes usually as energy and that's the only type of nocturno you can get and it has fixed stats so you can't change these at all but what um, epic games did uh, some of the different developers of the game gave out um, a few different like fire nocturnos uh, nature nocturnos and other weapons like that which shouldn't exist in the game and shouldn't have been made at all and they are so they, they've regretted it so much and they're furious that they have to go back and reverse all this and I'm going to be talking later on in today's video about um, some of the things they'll be doing very soon to try and remove these but you guys can actually use these weapons before they actually get removed. People with these schematics right now are trading their weapons for a ton of items. People are giving over like power 100 weapons um, in bulk for these items just to get with their hands on just one of them and possibly these people that are, keep getting all these different schematics could get banned but I don't think it's highly unlikely that they will get banned because it was Epic Games mistake in the first place for giving out all of these weapons. Now I've actually managed to get myself some gameplay. I found a person that has an energy grave digger and he won't say exactly how he managed to get it because he doesn't want to get him his account banned or anything and I'm not going to be showing his gamertag in today's video or anything like that but how he said that he mainly got it was because he played during um, the Halloween update and I think it was called Fort Nightmares and he was supposed to get the Gravedigger but didn't get given it and they removed it from his account and then he came back to play the game recently and then he realised it wasn't there um, after playing it during that event so now he is really annoyed and sent in a support ticket and then he managed to get uh, a custom Gravedigger with the energy as the element on it with some insane stats the damage that it does is incredible now the, the main weapon schematics that Epic Games have been handing out are the guns like the Drum Roll, the Nocturno, the Gravedigger the Hydra and the Super 
Shredder. Those are the main schematics because other people don't really want some of the, like the lower tier weapons um, as schematics. So they've been asking peop um, Epic Games to give them the Nocturno and other weapons like that because of course they're the rarest weapons. But there's only a small supply of these schematics so it makes them incredibly rare. So here is the Energy Gravedigger. I managed to get a guy uh, to show me it and then he actually dropped me a level 130 version of it. And he can actually craft these which is insane. Um, he also had one of the Nature Nocturno which is also another very rare weapon out right now as a schematic that barely anybody has their hands on. Um, but he doesn't have the schematic for that, he just has a version because he found somebody that had the schematic also. Now I turned off my HUD in this gameplay because I don't want to show off my gamer tag and I don't want um, Epic Games to maybe find this video and try and think that I was the one that modded this weapon or asked for it because I wasn't. I just wanted to show it off in the video and make you guys aware that these are out there um, and people might even use this to try and scam you because they could possibly show the energy version and as you saw when the guy dropped it for me, um, it didn't have any element on the actual weapon so you be careful um, when training for this. Make sure uh, that if you do try and get one of these schematics, uh, one of these weapons rather then make sure that is actually the element on it that you want it um, with the modded version and not the um, normal base version because people could definitely use this to try and scam you now in a second I'm going to show you the stats of this um, energy grave digger it's absolutely insane it's got like plus 10 damage on every single stage of level up um, which makes it so overpowered and uh, possibly a few people might you might see these using in missions um, as more and more people begin to craft the weapons but soon I'm po possibly sure that they're going to be removing these weapons and maybe in a few minutes time after showing you guys off these weapons I'll uh, explain to you what they're going to try and do to remove them and here is I think he switches to the nature nocturno very soon um, so I'll get to show this off to you guys as well in my opinion, this Nature Nocturno looks even more insane than the normal Nocturno and people would definitely pay huge amounts to get their hands on this. Okay guys, so here are the stats for the new 130. This is the only version of the 130 Gravedigger um, in the whole wide world. Um, the only schematic that you can get for it rather because he made me one. Um, so we've got the 130 right here. Uh, we'll look at the stats right now. It does plus 10% extra damage, um, and then 20% long, 21% longer durability, and then a 15% extra damage, 28% longer durability, plus 20% damage, and then energy um, affliction damage, which uh, compared to the normal Grave Digger, which only has crit chance damage to afflicted targets, crit ch uh, damage, and then a bit of damage, and then fire for six seconds, and I think. This may be six seconds as well. Um, effective against, yeah, I don't think it says anything. But it changes damage type to energy, as you guys can see there. So it's clearly um, like a, a, a modded type of the weapon uh, because it says changes it to it. Um, it does five uh, 5,300 damage, um, which compared to the Nocturno 106 is incredibly um, buffed. And side by side, when you put the fire uh, grave digger and energy grave digger, you guys can see, look, it's got the blue on the front with the energy, which is similar to the Nocturno, which we're giving away. You guys can get involved in the Nocturno giveaway down in the description of today's video uh, from the Gleam link. But look, this, the bullets follow the enemies. Um, this now does it on the grave digger as well, which is insane. Um, and then the fire grave digger, which just shoots out fire pellets. Um, so it's insane. It, it looks really, really good in my opinion. Um, I'm one of the holders of the only 130 grave diggers, which is incredible. Um, hopefully, if they do decide to remove this, then they'll probably either change it back to a normal grave digger, or they'll um, like recycle it. They'll recycle all of the 130s or any of the energy grave diggers and other like nature nocturnos, fire nocturnos, and just give you the materials for them. Um, or they'll change them back. So that's it's insane. Um, hopefully my account doesn't get banned or whatever um, because Checker said in his video you could possibly um, get that. So yeah, I don't know. But yeah, it, it's insane how they've changed this weapon so much and side by side they look so different but look so much better. So we can clearly see with longer damage plus um, in total I think that's about 45% extra damage. Um, and then we've got uh, almost 50% longer durability. So this weapon's going to last a lot longer than the normal Grave Digger. Um, and it's also going to have a lot more damage. Um, and then also the energy damage, which is going to make this an OP weapon. Um, and that's one of the reasons why a ton of people are giving so many different weapons and actual cash for this weapon before it gets removed in hope that it doesn't get taken away. Because some people have actually lost their weapons already, um, but a lot of people have actually kept them. So we don't know yet whether they're fully going to remove it. It, which on reddit they're they're talking about like fully getting rid of them 
Um, which, in the, if, if that's what they want, then they'll definitely try and get rid of every single one of them. Now, an official Epic Games developer on Reddit has just posted um, re and replied to somebody saying that they found somebody with a Nature Nocturno, and they replied, um, We agree that the process for granting things like this um, needed to be looked at and revised. Something like that should never have been granted to one person, as we know that they could spread from one schematic. The picture here could have been a couple of things. Maybe an older schematic changed, or a, pe a player has crafted the weapon and gave it to him. So, it's definitely, they, they understand the fact that people have been dropping weapons and giving it to each other and this could easily spread the weapons across multiple different accounts so the issue is much larger than they started off with. Now the same developer also said since that issue was brought to light we've been revising our support teams and processes revolving around granting items and perks for different issues that come up and something like that shouldn't happen again so they're basically just saying that um, if this error ever happens again they will not be given out um, certain rewards and I'll probably just mainly give out V-Bucks to say sorry to people for issues happening. Thank you guys all for watching the whole of today's video. If you have, then make sure to comment Modded Guns OMG in the comment section down below and I'll be liking all of the comments that I've got this far and send that comment and also trying to reply to most of them. Um, also, make sure to let me know whether you're going to be trying to get your hands on some of these weapons before they're removed um, just so you can mess about with them or whether you know anybody or have seen these weapons before and tell, let me know the craziest weapons that you've seen personally such as maybe a Fire Nocturno or a different type of version of an insanely rare weapon which makes it even rarer if somebody has a schematic for it. Now that just about does it for today's video. We have covered everything that I needed to say and hopefully you guys have been aware now of the type of weapons that are in the game and have very rare and modded um, so yeah if you let if you've learned something new from today's video make sure to drop a like show your friends so they can see some of these insane weapons that they probably have never seen before because most of the people I've told about today didn't even know about it so yeah this is unfortunately the end of today's video and I'll catch up with you guys in the next one so peace out until next time